Hello everyone, this is Thomas Stout 25 with you, and I'm continuing the Let's Play Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. Here's our house in the Dark World, and as you can see, he sells bombs. Let's talk to him. 100 rubies for 30 bombs, no thanks. As you can see, I have 50 bombs max and 50 arrows max, and that's all you can have in the game. That's really all you need. I mean, hell, you don't even need that. Alright, let's go here and bomb this. I think this guy, uh, I think he gives you rubies, I think. Yeah, he gives you rubies. First off, we're gonna bomb this up here. I don't really need rubies, but eh, why not? Yay! Rubies! Okay. Well, I'm going to try to get through Castle, well, I probably won't get completely through it, but I'll try to get through Castle 2 here, but there's one more item I want to get before I go there, since it's, well, right over here. God darn stupid rock. Gosh darn it. Stupid rocks. Alright. Aw, oh, you jerks. Ooh, rubies. Don't need them, but still rubies. Alright, go over here. Let's, well, use our magic mirror. And now we're up here. And up here we have... What do we have here? Hold up the Master Sword and you will get the magic of Bombos. Bombos. Bombos something. I can't read today. It's too early in the morning. This is the Bombos Medallion. Its magic makes the ground explode with power. Watch your magic meter. Alright, now that that's done and over with, let's go back to our little portal here and let's head on to castle number two. Okay. There's something you want to do before you go here, though. You want to get right here? Use the magic mirror. And go through here. Alright, we've been here before, haven't we? Yeah, we've been here before. Okay, what we want to do here is... Is anything you do in the light world will have an effect in the dark world. So if you pull that and let the water come out and be everywhere, then we get in our portal. And we go back in. It would have a dramatic effect on it. If you came in here before pulling that, this wouldn't be full of water. Hey, it is I, Shahazara. Objects exist simultaneously in both worlds with similar shapes. If the form of a thing changes, it will affect the shape of its twin in the other world. And that's how we have water here now. Okay. Yay, our first key. Up we go. Down we go. Up, down, left, right. Whatever. Okay, we'll go over here and bomb this. Oh, I can't remember if there's anything over there or not, but why the hell not? Ow. Oh, it's a chest. And we have the map. I right, just push the X button to use it. Uh, I guess I'll show you the dungeon. This only has two, three floors, two basements in the first floor. Ah, I don't need that magic thing anyway. Okay, I think there's a key over here. One of these pots. Ah, uh, was correct. All right, let's go through this door. Do a quick save state. Those guys just get annoying. Those damn red bones. Alright, and if you, whatever you hit, that thing will shoot fire at you. Gosh darn it, get out of my way. I want to go up here first to get this secret key that they just have lying around. 
All right. Now we'll go up. Nothing there. Okay. Can't push that. Let's go through here. Hmm, what is over here? Let's bomb it. I mean, hell, we have 50 bombs. Why not? What do we have over here? Eh, just some rubies and a bomb. Eh, nothing too special. Okay, now that we Wait a minute. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Alright, I was... I was like, well, wait a minute, do I want to do this yet? But I remember that I just came from over there. Use your head, Thomas. Use your head. There you go. Alright, now we can swim over here. And from here, I want to go down. Yes, I want to go down. And I have dogs, stupid dogs, barking. Sorry about that, folks. And I want to go this way. Die, stupid fish. We want to go this way. Watch out for the stupid fish. Get this piece. Get that heart. Piece of heart. Yeah, right. They don't put pieces of hearts in castles. Push that. And what do we have here? What the compass? You found the compass. Ow. I hit my hand on my, on my computer desk. And the boss is way up there. Okay. Now where do we have to go? Alright, well, we have the big chest right there. Might have to go through here. Let's take a look. Die, stupid red bone. Okay, so... I'm guessing there's a switch somewhere. Ow, that was stupid. Nice job, Thomas. Can you go up here? I think so. Aha, we have ourselves a key. I don't think I can push these, can I? Okay, yeah, those are the ones I can't push. So we need to go this way. Now we need to go up. Oh my gosh, the stupid fish got me. Go through here. We want to have that be red, so avoid the spikes and push this. Alright, we want to keep that red, so we need to go around. Just trust me, just keep it red. Alright, now let's go back to where we were so we can go swimming. Yay, for swimming. Alright, swim over here. I really don't know what's up here, but I'm gonna go here anyway. Oh, it's just a heart. I guess I could use a heart. Oh, two hearts. The game loves me. I'm gonna do a save state. Just in case my computer flips out on me. Because you just, you never know with my computer. So I wanna go up. I don't think I want to. Eh, let's go up. What the hell? There's nothing up. Alright, so we're gonna push the bottom one over and push this one. Now we wanna go up. Okay, from here, we're on floor one. I think we wanna go down here, I think. Might be something. No, just three hearts. I can always use the health, so I mean, not a bad trade off. Um, let's see here. Yeah, let's go this way first. Why the hell not? We gotta come back anyway. And we get 20 rubies. Very good. All right. Let's go back up and go to the right. Stupid little... I don't know what the hell they are. Look like little clay figures and they just jump up and down. Oh, don't hit me. All right, push this one and let's go this way. See, this is why I uh, wanted it red, because if it was blue, I'd have to jump down and go back and switch it. Oh, what do we have over here? We have the big key! Alright. Now we need to go for the big chest. And we know where that's at. Downward we go. And where we stop, nobody knows. Okay, go for another swim. Ow. 
over. Save stated again, just in case. What possibly could we have in the chest? Boing! This is the hook shot. It extends and contracts, and boing! You can grapple many things. All right. We just happen to have a key just lying around. All right, that's really everything in this room. So I just want to grapple over here and go to the door. All right, now we want to go. Um, sure, let's go downstairs first. Let's go over here to the right. Um, okay, let's not go over to the right. Good job, Thomas. Aren't you an idiot? Oh, I know what I have to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scream at the screen, folks. Call me an idiot. Alright. Push this thing and go up. Now we want to go over to the right. And go to this door. That's what I wanted to do. Okay. Oh, that son of a gun. Electrifying me. Jerk. Okay. Get the heart. And now push this. That drains the water. Now we can go down here and through this door. And I think we want to go up. No, we want to go back down. We want to get some treasure first. Yay for treasure. Yay. Yay. I think I might have enough time to finish this dungeon if I hurry. Let's go. Okay, if you push this... This chest appears, and you get 20 rubies. Get out of my way. Walk through the waterfall, Link. And go up here, screw those guys. Screw you guys. Swim for the key. Get the key, get the hell out of there. Swim. There's just hearts and stuff up there, but I don't have time to get it. Swim! Can I beat this guy in three minutes? Alright, what you want to do here is you just want to hook shot and swing. I have the uh, red sword, so it just takes one swing. If you had the master sword, I think it takes three swings. This is another reason why I went and got the sword first. Come on, grapple. Right, this guy's the easiest boss in the game. Now, what he's going to do is jump, and he's going to land. And then you hit him, and he jumps, and he lands, and you hit him, and he jumps. He lands, and you hit him, and he jumps. Same pattern over and over and over, and then he dies. And now we get our, see, that'd be our third crystal in the dark world. I guess I had a lot more time than what I thought I did. All right. Hey, because of you, I can escape from the clutches of the evil monsters. Thank you. The Triforce will grant the wish wishes of whoever touches it. As long as that person lives, that is why it was hidden in the Golden Land. Only a secret few knew of its location. But at some point, that knowledge was lost. The person who rediscovered the Golden Land was Ganondorf, the evil thief. Luckily, he couldn't figure out how to return to the Light World. Well, remember that you have magical powers which only the hero can make of most of. There are some other magical warping points, like the one you saw in Death Mountain. By using them, you can go between the two worlds and find the evils hidden in the Dark World. You are the only one who can destroy Ganon Golf, the thief, the thief known Ganon, the evil king of darkness. Do you understand? Yes, I do. May the way of the hero lead you to the Triforce. Okay, everybody. Well, I'm going to end the episode here, and in our next episode, we're going to go up there to Castle 3. So this has been Thomas Stout 25 saying, see you later, and have a good day.